Hey everybody, Scotty G here from Listen Up, and I would like to introduce you to Lenny from Hi-Fi Robes. Hey, this is Lenny, and I am with MoFi Distribution. One of the products we distribute, and lovingly so, is the Hi-Fi Rose DAC, streamer, server, preamp, digital tuner. I call it Allen Iverson. You got a question, it's got the answer. Me and Scotty G are gonna go over it, kind of bring you into it, get you as much information as we can, and also let you know that we share the same barber. Brothers from a different mother we are, for sure. Yeah, the Hi-Fi Rose product is something we're really excited about here at Listen Up. All of us are a big fan of their streamers, their integrated amplifiers. It's a great product. We're gonna have a lot of fun today talking about it. Before we dive into the RS-150, give us a little background on Hi-Fi Rose. Hi-Fi Rose is a uh, Korean company that has been around for many, many years. Huge engineering staff. What they do is build digital interfaces. So you go to the airport, you're putting into the kiosk, they're the company that designs that. So their background is really good at digital interfaces, very intuitive. Um, very simple to use. They understand how humans interact with it. And that gives them a uh, advantage of a lot of audiophile companies that don't quite understand that. But really the key to this is passion. The CEO of Hi-Fi Rose is an extreme audiophile. So he took some of their best engineers and created a whole team just to start building these products. So they have some features and some um, advantages that nobody is doing and they do it in such a simple way. A lot of times in audiophile products, we get ahead of ourselves. It's a great idea, but it's too difficult to use and people don't use it. That's the total opposite with Hi-Fi Rose. They make it so easy to use, it inspires you to use it. So that's really, if I want to take one word for Hi-Fi Rose as a company, it is passion. It is their passion for audio and ease of use that created this product. Wow, so this is really taking the idea of a traditional audio component to a whole new level. Yeah, you know, I've been doing this 30 years, I've owned a retail store, and one of the things I've discovered is, to me, customers come in two different flavors, alpha and omega, and many different variations and gradations of that. Alpha is a strict audio file, A. Omega is an ordinary consumer. This is a product that serves both of them. If you're really tweaky and you want to get into this, what's great about the Hi-Fi Rose is that you have menus. Here you go for settings. Then I can go to audio settings and I can uh, do all my input output. This is a graphical representation of what's in the back. So a lot of times if things are put in the back, you can't see it. This gives you an idea of what's on, how it's plugged in, where are the sections. This saves a lot of time not just for install, but for customers at home, if they want to see, oh, do I have a, say, a optical in? I don't remember. They hit this button, now they can see that. It's so intuitive and formulaic uh, for a use. People use this product. And you know what? The thing is, it's fun. So now I can go into my input output settings, uh, hit here, and I have all these, um, menus I can choose from. I can choose my digital filters. If I'm an audio file, I can do a fast filter, a fast roll off. I can show my DSD native. However, if I'm an O customer, an ordinary customer, it's plug and play. It's ready to go. You know, you just follow the instructions as for getting onto the, uh, your network. If you're either going, uh, 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 hardwired or you're going wireless it's really easy to use I am not a digital guy I am an analog specialist I got one of these first and I had it running from box to performance in 20 minutes and that's a big deal I had to ask somebody what my password was but that's a different story so one of the things that I like about it is when I talk about fun it's fun so now I'm gonna have on this front panel you have these icons which are basically apps so one of the things I really love is I like digital radio. So this is what they call Rose FM. What's cool about Rose FM is that not only can I get digital radio, I can watch it 4K video out. I can see what station I'm looking at. That is unheard of. It's so interactive. Another thing is, is if I turn the dial, you can see the pointer. It's moving. It does things. I mean, this is incredible what this can do. 
But going on to the idea of video out and why that's so special. This has HDMI for video K out. And we have a little button here called Rose Tube, which connects you to YouTube. And what's nice about it is now I can search and I'm gonna search for Dua Lipa. And she should come up pretty quickly. There it is, I'm gonna get her tiny desk from NPR. And we're gonna watch that. Now this is a DAC streamer server but it also puts out 4K video. So on the bottom, it has a little container where you can put an SSD drive. So if you have home video movies that you've now transferred to a digital format, you can watch home video, you can watch YouTube. And one of the things that most people don't think about, especially in the A version, the audiophile, but the ordinary consumer, the largest streaming service in the world is YouTube. There's tremendous video content and enjoyable features on YouTube that you can enjoy with this that is very, very special. So as a customer, no matter how you interact with your gear, who you are as a customer, an alpha, an omega, this is the product for you. You can keep dig digging into it, you can keep tweaking it, or you can leave it alone and enjoy it. We have two at my house. My wife uses one, I use one. I'm the audiophile. She's the ordinary person. She's listening to podcasts on it, and especially on the uh, Rose Tube feature. You, you know, you can search for Love Boat. She searched for Love Boat, and it will search the entire database, get the highest bit rate, the highest bandwidth, the most fidelity, bring it back, and if there's commercials, they get rid of them, Scotty. Wow, man, this thing is really cool. I really like how it can, uh... Uh, remind you of an old school receiver with the FM dial, especially like the VU meters. Yeah, man, that's my favorite part. <laughs> At the end of the day, it's about music with me. So it comes already installed with Cobuzz, Tidal, Rune Endpoint. This does DSD, MQA. Again, anything you throw at it, it's doing. But I'm gonna show you one of the things that I really love. You go to Cobuzz, I can pick anything. Let's say I do this and then we're gonna get her playing. And from there, we're gonna have some fun. So one of the things I really like to do is even when I am listening to my turntables, which I have four of, I love them. What I'll do is I'll put on a dummy CD. It's about three hours long. I'll put it into this so I can just see the meters move. This thing is so fantastic, but here's the great thing. What's your color scheme? You can keep picking every meter you want. So every day it feels like I have a new piece of hi-fi. I will go in here and if I'm listening to, these remind me of old techniques meters. What do you say, 1983 about? Yeah, I think so. So I listen to 83 music, I'm putting these meters on. I mean, I really interact with it. I really have a good time with it. It just is something fantastic. It has where you can turn it down at night if you're listening. It has just all these, incredible interactive features. Now here's the thing, say that you're a big Macintosh fan and you like this as a digital streaming device and all your Macintosh meters are moving around. You're like, man, I wish I had Mac meters. Well, guess what? You do. So again, you have a question. The Hi-Fi Rose is the answer. The RS-150 is the flagship streamer from Hi-Fi Rose. Obviously it has a large 14 inch screen but what makes it sound so good? Well, not only is it the screen, which is adds to the, you know, immersiveness and ease to use. And, you know, you can actually, if you have it, you don't have a video, you can actually watch a video on the screen, which is great. But when we talk about audio, first of all, it's the chassis, fully milled aluminum chassis. Even this Hi-Fi Rose is milled in. It uses a Femto cloth. Mm. Oh. Mm. The Hi-Fi Rose uses a Femto clock, but what's this special is its topology, its architecture. It's fully symmetrical differential. That means it's a truly balanced unit. So uh, in the DAC section, it's a balanced DAC section. It's quieter, more dynamic, greater low level resolution. It's using the Sabre Pro DAX, smooth, big sounding. Um, and again, it has some features that are great with kind of catering to your sound with the digital filters. Fast roll off, slow roll off, brick wall filters. You can kind of cater that analog play to suit what you 
like best. Um, it has I squared bus out, it has arc in, HDMI wow. out. So in the future, if we get some new digital format, you can go digital out and it still has growth capability. You'll still be able to use this fantastic touch screen that you've gotten used to. So it has a future proof to it, up until as good as digital can be future proof, but it sounds spectacular. I'm not a huge digital listen to -er, but I have found ways to put this into my system and use it in many different ways. I use it almost like a digital bedding system. I'll get on Cobuzz. Man, I found this great French jazz trio that does mm. Almond Brother covers. Oh. I heard Statesboro Blues done by this girl with this great French accent, and I'm like, I'm buying that record. Until I listen to the rest of the record oh, wow. and realize, no, I like that song. <laughs> I downloaded that song. So it saves me money by getting to listen to stuff with high resolution, kind of catered the way I like in my presentation. And if I fall in love with it, I'm like, yeah, I'm buying that record. So I really have found many ways to use this, but here's the thing, it sounds good it really has the it, it ticks the buttons and boxes that i like big dynamics great low level resolution emphasizes musical detail over just detail detail i don't care about hearing the guy in the third row click his pin i want a busendorfer to sound like a busendorfer i want a les paul to sound like a les paul i want to strap the scream that's what i want so this does that in spades it's ease of use, it's interactiveness. The sound quality is just a cherry on the top. Man, wow, this thing really just generates a lot of those aha moments. Um, I know it did for me just based on all the things it does. What about you, Lenny, the audio lover? What, what do you like most about it? Well, I I'm gonna do something that uh, most salesmen never admit doing. I'm gonna tell you the absolute truth. I was on a, a podcast or YouTube with David Solomon, who <laughs> runs uh, Cobuzz. Everybody knows him, wonderful human being. And he was telling me, John was on too. He was telling me about uh, this new streamer called Hi-Fi Rose. First thing that comes in my mind is, what? I don't want anything like that. Hi-Fi Rose, what's going on? Then my aha moment was when I got one. And the word I can tell you is connected. Not just connectedness that I can connect it to a TV or I have so many different options. I connect with it. So, you know, we'd have parties at our house and we'd never have music or I'd have a, like a little, you know, radio playing and I have this huge system. It's because I have a bunch of turntables. I'm not going to be a DJ. I'm not going to have a Christmas party and keep dropping needles. I'm just not going to do it. First of all, my nickname at MoFi is the Cartridge Slayer. I'd be breaking <laughs> cartridges. I'd be moving too quickly. No, but really what I love doing is building playlists now. So I get on Cobuzz and I'll spend hours connecting with it, searching all these databases, finding this wonderful music, Christmas list. I have, oh, 4th of July mix. I just do it, do it, do it. So much so that there's a Lenny's list on Cobuzz somewhere. Yeah, I put songs for everybody to have. I just, me and Dave are always finding stuff. I will spend hours searching these databases to find new music, because look, I need to be inspired just like everyone else. I, I, I you know, I, I can get jaded. This is what I do for a living. I listen to the same stuff. No, man, this is open to my aha moment was when I connected to it, connected to the interface. I'm 52 years old and I really do not like apps. I'm sorry. Uh, I don't like using my hi-fi with my phone. Uh, for a long time, I had four apps. Two of them told me how fast their turntable went. I don't even have Uber. This has a phenomenal app called Rose Connect. Works both on uh, your Android platform plus your Apple platform, but you don't have to have an app. It comes with a wonderful Bluetooth remote and the touchscreen. I connect with it. I touch it every day. It's something that I connect with. And I connect with it not just in a physical way. Uh, I also connect with it in an intellectual way. It's always um, challenging me to find to do stuff and you know, making me more technical on how to get on networks. And it's really expanded my vision of what music can be in a home and what a music lover could advance from that. So if I would ask my aha moment is when I connected it and when I connected to it. Wow, man. Well, that, this is, uh, that concludes our review of the RS-150. Lenny Man, want to thank you very much for coming out and talking with us. Um, you know, it's an awesome piece. You're an awesome guy. It's an awesome company. 
Thank you. Uh, some of that's true. Um, but really, uh, I appreciate the time to talk about it. It's a product I love. If you have any questions, you can find me online. You can reach out to the guys at Listen Up. Ask for a demo. It is something you have to touch, see. It, it, it is an interactive piece. Come in, get a demo, and bring it home and enjoy it. Take care. If you'd like to find out more about Hi-Fi Rose and the RS150 in particular, please visit our website, listenup.com. Visit any of our retail stores. Be sure to like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. We got a lot of great content coming this way. We want you guys to see it.